Have you made a lot of money out of your music? Money? I mean, what is, how, much is, how much is a lot of money to you? Yeah, that's a good question. Have, have you made, say, millions of dollars? No. Are you a rich man? What do you mean rich? What do you mean? Do you have a lot of possessions? A lot of well, money in the bank? Possession make you rich? I don't, I don't have that type of richness. My richness is life forever. Of course, new Pioneers. Today is Thursday, February 6, 2020. And guess what? Today, Today is also National, National Frozen, Frozen Yogurt Day. Day. Sorry. Let's try that again. I think we messed up. All right. All right. Today, Today is National Frozen Yogurt Day. Day. Yogurt. Chopsticks. Yogurt. Are you saying yogurt? Yeah, because it's National Frozen Yogurt Day. Well, it's also National Chopsticks Day. Well, you know what? Let's combine the two, you know, because I've been looking for something to eat these All right. yogurt with. You got it? Yeah. Are you sure? Mm-hmm. Are you positive? No. Okay. Well, I guess that combination didn't work. However, we have another combination for you guys as our Today in History segment. Today has to be a very big day for two famous and awesome musicians. To start off, I'm celebrating the birth of the legendary Bob Marley. He was a Jamaican singer and songwriter and was also considered to be one of the pioneers of reggae. Did you say pioneer? That's right. And of course, this star was born this day, February 6, 1945. Well, now let's go back from that date by just two years. On this day in history, 1943, Frank Sinatra made his debut. He was heard singing on the radio for the first time, and since then, he was dubbed as the biggest name in the business. Not to mention, he was also the biggest heartthrob of the 40s. Well, congratulations, Frank Sinatra. And happy birthday, Bob Marley. Also, according to my calendar, it happens to also be time to celebrate National, National Counselors Week. Week. We would just like to give a huge pie out to all the amazing counselors at Western that continue to empower and support us. We really do appreciate all the support and the care that you've provided for us. We would also like to thank you for empowering us to make something out of our lives post high school. Well, let's get on to the show. I'm Tiffany. And I'm Lucy. And, and this, this is the Pioneer, Pioneer Press Musician, Musician Edition. Edition. Did we have graphics for Bob Rudy? Attention Pios, this week is Love Week. Don't forget to participate in this week's Spirit Week and show your spirit each day of the week by dressing up or participating. Today is wear blue or spirit wear. And on Friday, participate in the Cuts for Cancer. Cuts for Cancer is an opportunity for students like you to donate to cancer, cancer patients in need. If you guys are interested in donating your hair, sign up in the, at the ASB room at lunch. You can even choose a friend to cut your hair for you. Ooh, and feel free to ask any ASB member if you have any questions or concerns. Other than Cuts for Cancer, there will be Marquee Love Week messages all around campus and ne all next week. Purchase a Marquee message for yourself or your loved ones. It's only a $3 purchase. They will be sold in front of the ASB room at lunch every day till the end of the week. On top of that, ASB will be selling Valentine Grams. You'll get three Jolly Rancher lollipops plus a note of your choice for only $2. Who wouldn't want to get a Jolly Rancher lollipop? I know I would. Pre-orders are going to be sold outside the ASB room at lunch until Friday the 13th. So hurry up and pre-order your Valentine grants for the people you love. Of course. Have you been thinking about your classes for next year? No. Well, counselors will be coming out to talk to you soon. We are offering graphic communications zero period in the fall of 2020. It's a great way to wake up each day with a fun and creative class. Sign up for zero period graphic communications on your registration card. You need to take graphics if you want to take honors advanced graphic communications. So come by room 56 this week to get more information about the amazing graphics class that will be offered in the fall. Graphic communication is open to all of you pioneers. Come by room 56 today. Do you like to make things with your hands? Oh, do you like to do you like variety? Are you crafty? Do you like 
using different tools and media. If this is you, sign up for 3D Design next year. You will get to expand your creativity while exploring a wide range of sculpture and fine arts crafts projects. Registration for next year is just around the corner. See Miss Kirby in room 26 if you have any questions. If you want to do something crafty and artsy and hands-on, but don't want to wait until next year, the 15th annual chalk art event is still looking for students to participate. So if you're interested in this event, you must turn in a completed colored drawing to Miss Moen in room 40 by Friday, February 7th. That's tomorrow, so draw something that reflects your own cultural heritage or, or supports this year's International Week theme. One mind, one voice, one love. This creative Western tradition will be held on Tuesday, February 18th to kick off the beginning of International Week. See Miss Moen in room 40 if you have any questions. Juniors, class of 2021, pay attention because this announcement is it's just, just for, for you. Do you want to earn a $600 scholarship? Are you interested in being an intern with this summer? <laughs> with <laughs> the local companies? <laughs> Check your email for the summer AIM internship application. This application deadline is this. The deadline is this Friday, February 7th at midnight. So, so don't, don't wait. wait. Included with this is an informational application as well as a Thrively assignment that you must complete before prior to the deadline. Internships begin at June and are five weeks long. Have you do you have any questions? Contact Ms. Kreiner by uh, email or stop by her room at room forty five. Seniors, if you're still having trouble finding scholarship, then make sure to check your email. Ms. Cress has sent you to help out. In other news, if you haven't already figured, Grad night is not in the senior package, so you will need to pay out of pocket. We're sorry about the news. It really sucks, but Disneyland will be worth it. Seniors, this message is also for you. Senior night at Medieval Times is coming up. It is free if you got the senior package and, four, and 42 without. Please fill out the paperwork and turn in money by next Friday, February 14th at the ASB Accounts Office. Mental Health Awareness Club will be meeting in room 15 tomorrow, Friday. Make, Make sure, sure to come out. Attention all Key Club members, Key Club will be having a meeting today at lunch in the Media Center. Sign up for upcoming volunteer opportunities and we'll be opening up appointed bar positions for the new term. So make sure to come back to today's meeting to learn more information about this new opportunity and other community service events. Attention Pioneers, would you like to know more about eSports gaming and build up your professional skills in a future workplace environment? Well, uh, Vonza will be hosting two field trips. The first one is the eSports field trip that will take place Saturday, February 8th from 8.30 to 3 p.m. in the Mission Viejo Microsoft Store. And transportation and lunch will be provided. Just make sure to bring your own devices. At the career-based field trip that will be taking place on, on the 15th from 8.30 to 3 p.m. at the Microsoft Viejo Store. Uh, transportation will also be provided if and lunch. Any questions? Please go to room 53 after school. Well, that's all we have for today, Pios. But of course, if you want to be featured as a wayback, throwback, or flashback, or if you'd like to give a pie out to a club sport athlete, scholar, friend, teacher, or staff, we'll be happy to do so. Now make sure you follow us on all your favorite social media platforms using Ask the Pio Press. And keep on hashtagging your photos using hashtag Pio Press. And finally, don't forget to have a terrific, tremendous, thankful, thrilling Thursday. Thursday. And we'll see you all tomorrow. Press on, Pios!